What's up everybody, Dr. Bo here, your San Diego chiropractor, and I've got one of my favorite practice members with me, the one and only Arthur, and he's gonna share a little bit about what brought him into the office uh, initially, and how he's been feeling, and some of the conditions that he's been dealing with, so it's all yours, let him know, Arthur. Well, I came into the office because I've always had back problems. I've grown up and I've had scoliosis, uh, tightness of the back, um, tightness in my neck, and so for about a year or two, I haven't been having any kind of chiropractor treatment. And so I sought out to try to help myself out and help my immune system feel better and just be preventative. Yeah, and he does a very excellent job of, of exercising and taking care of himself. So really this has been the centerpiece to hold everything together. And just, just in case people don't know what scoliosis is, it's when rather than your spine going up straight like that, that there's curves throughout it. So that's what's been happening with Arthur and that's what he grew up with. So you're gonna see some imbalances throughout the spine and what our big goal is, is not to reverse it and bring that back to its natural state, which is essentially impossible to do, but to bring as much motion as we can into the spine. So I know one of the things we do every single time with him is we use the Arthur gun, which we won't do today, but we use that to dig in there, bring motion in, and then we give some really powerful and strong adjustments to open that up. And then the more that he exercises and stretches, the better it is because now those muscles start to relax. So Arthur, what, uh, what's been the biggest change that you've noticed since you started Care Up? And I think it's been about a month or two now for you. What's the biggest notice, uh, thing that you noticed thus far? Well, I like the neck adjustment, so it's helped with my uh, movement of my neck, and um, it's helped me with my workouts. So I've noticed a lot of more free, free range of motion. Again, there's still limitations, but it's definitely improved and helped myself out in my workouts. And it's a journey, right? We can't fix everything overnight. So let's go ahead. We'll get, we're going to get those glasses off. I'm going to get you to lie face down for me. And one of the things that we're gonna notice with, with Arthur right off the bat, if you come on over here, number one, there's gonna be leg length imbalance. So right leg is gonna be just slightly longer than the left, left is gonna be short. And if you take a look throughout his spine, is that there's changes in the curvature. So you're gonna see that this side is gonna be slightly more raised. There's a raise that's coming here. This is gonna be a dip down and there's a slope that's happening here as well. And no matter no matter what condition your spine is in, you can benefit from chiropractic care. One of the things I notice here is that the right is long in the first position, it remains long in the second position, which could potentially indicate that we have a sacrum that's rotated this way, PR, posterior rotated sacrum on that side. All right, so let's get the spine to relax a bit. Big deep breath in, all the way out. Big deep breath in, all the way out. Beautiful. Awesome. So main thing we feel for is motion. One of the things I'm gonna notice is right here, a little bit of motion and this right here, very little, but it pretty much feels like a rock throughout. So what our goal is, is to get as much motion into this sacrum. And as we work our way up the spine, one of the things that we feel is that this starts curving this way and rather than it go, dipping down towards the belly, it actually comes up. So this is a very, unique and amazing spine to work on and he can really benefit from getting some incredible motion. So Arthur, as you know, we're gonna chip away, we're gonna do some powerful drops in here, big deep breath in, all the way out. Right, there you go. Big deep breath in, all the way out. Nice. And with him, our main objective is motion, motion, motion. So we're gonna keep chipping away. And you're gonna notice that we don't hear that popping noise, which is an awesome way for us to adjust into this. If someone isn't too keen on the twisting and the popping, we have this option available. So we're just gonna let that relax there for a second. Perfect, big deep breath in again, all the way up. Now we're gonna go ahead and just retest this area. And right now his sacrum is moving a million times better. And we're gonna start chipping away on this arc right here. Big deep breath in. There it is, a little extra oomph. Big deep breath in. Nice, keep that going. Yes! Oh my goodness. That is moving so amazing on you. We're gonna do one more just up top right here. Cool, now when we retest this, it's gonna line up perfectly. 
which is indicating that his sacrum, the lower portion of the spine here is clear. What we're gonna focus on next is gonna be releasing his mid thoracic region. And when you have a spine that is not, doesn't have the proper ideal alignment, it's gonna borrow from other areas and create compensations. So with Arthur, what we wanna do is get as much motion in from here to here as we can before we address his cervical spine. So go ahead and flip onto your back for me. All right, so one of the things that's happening with Arthur is just because of the, the shape of the spine that it can be challenging to extend back. And that's one of our long-term goals is to be able to lie down with ease in that position. And we're gonna go ahead and find a few different spots right here, big deep breath in, let it out, let it out. Yes, amazing, one more a little bit higher, breathe it out, yes, and then all the way up top, breathe it out, breathe it out, let it relax, Whew. now your favorite part, my man. All right, and Arthur, it's primarily through, throughout the day we're behind a computer desk, correct? Correct. So big all thing, day. all day, right? So what do you think that does to your neck if we're spending all that time looking at a computer screen. Doesn't help it out. Doesn't help it. So one of the things that we talk about big time is posture, making sure that we don't spend too much time on the computer and our own technology use. We don't wanna be looking down at our phone if you're forced to stare at a computer screen. But nonetheless, there's certainly a good amount of tension in this neck, so we're just stretching this area out, loosening it up on him. And then what we're gonna do is address a couple very important spots here. So number one, you're just gonna let that relax. Arthur, what I really want you to focus on is dropping that shoulder down right there and then right there. Whew. I think I think that's going to be a popular one right there. Oh, some good amount of noise. Beautiful, Arthur. And then what I want to do is get you leaping out of here a little bit taller. Here, come on up, my man. Beautiful. All right, sir. What do you want to tell the world about chiropractic? Well, it's definitely beneficial, especially in my uh, case. Um, it's good for my immune system. It's good for posture. It's good for the whole body. Very That's right. Good. Thank you.